these anti-Semitic incidents within our public school system uh, here in our city are happening multiple times a week. Investigations into disturbing incidents of anti-Semitism reported at the Toronto District School Board have sparked calls for emergency action and board-wide interventions. We are deeply concerned um, by this latest incident, which I have to tell you is really devastating. The latest described as a brazen, hurtful and hateful incident, an eighth grade Jewish teacher at Valley Park Middle School, a child of Holocaust survivors, was targeted. Came back into the room, several students surrounded her and gave her the Heil Hitler salute. To say that she has been traumatized by this incident is probably not strong enough language. A similar incident happened at another school a week and a half ago. The TDSB says there will be consequences for the students involved and an upcoming presentation at the school. But this wasn't the first case of anti-Semitism reported at the board. There was a, a, an incident involving um, anti-Semitic and anti-Roma um, graffiti. Uh, hateful graffiti at the school. A human rights organization says this is a systemic issue calling for the board to develop a comprehensive approach that involves the curriculum, educating teachers and families and developing resources. It's time to move away from the reactionary model of something happened two weeks ago. So in two weeks time, we're going to bring in uh, a presentation on the Holocaust to accepting the fact that we have a significant crisis in relation to anti-Semitism within our schools. The TDSB says it's been bringing Holocaust education programs to classrooms, including... I grew up in Toronto, and we had a very happy childhood. But there was always a secret. Caring testimony where families of Holocaust survivors share their stories as a form of education. Students see and hear things. Um, you know, we hear what's been going on in the world. We see what's been going on recently. Um, the truckers and you see a symbol, you see a symbol in a video game. They don't necessarily understand what it means and the impact of what it is. And that's why the education is so important. The board says it will do more, adding that they're also working with a number of organizations. We're going to work with many of the other organizations in Toronto. We have some fabulous organizations who all have different programs and skill sets, and we're going to just bring it together, and we're going to continue. The provincial government saying it's expanding curriculum and resources to fight anti-Semitism at schools. In Toronto, I'm Faiza Amin for City News.